Welcome to Whatcom Community College's e-learning orientation, getting started with online classes. There are many types of online classes. The first type, ONLs, are online classes we share with other colleges through the WAOL class system. These classes have different start and stop dates than other WCC courses, and instructors and students may be from other colleges. Classes created by Whatcom instructors for Whatcom Community Colleges will be marked on your schedule with OL. These are private courses that use our own start and stop dates, and instructors and students will all be from Whatcom Community College. Hybrid classes will be marked with an HY. Hybrid classes are private courses that are created at Whatcom and use our own start and stop dates. Instructors and students will be from WCC. A hybrid class replaces part of your seat time in a class with online time on our ANGEL system. Any class that uses the internet will be labeled with WE for Web Enhanced. Seat time in class is not replaced and you should expect to use the internet for turning in assignments, research, or other basic functions. Your printed schedule will use these various codes to show what type of online class you have. Let's take a look at some hints and advice that will make your e-learning experience better. Remember, online classes are not easier. They're just taught online. Classes online will take just as much time to complete as classes that are face-to-face. -face. Classes start the first day of the quarter. You need to be prepared. Even if you're in a hybrid class that doesn't meet face-to-face -face until three or four days into the quarter, your class starts the first day of the quarter. In most classes, there'll be an assignment on the first day. Remember that you are responsible for checking into your online classroom often and to keep up with work and other assignments. You need to make sure that you know when everything is due and when tests are. I call this the presence problem. In a face-to-face -face classroom, you have lots of people around you to remind you when things are due. In an online classroom, it all falls to you to keep up. Check into your classroom. Unlike a face-to-face -face classroom, an online instructor knows a lot about your habits. They know how often you've logged in, uh, whether you've checked the discussion board, how long you spend online. They know everything. Please be aware you cannot fool the instructor into thinking you're spending more time online than you really are. Week zero is an important concept for online students. You will have access to your classes online a week before the start of the quarter. As soon as you have access to your class, check for a week zero folder, a syllabus, or some kind of getting started folder. Look at the syllabus, see what you need to do, and find out which books you need to order or purchase. The week zero gives you a chance to get ahead and get prepared for the start of your online class, an advantage the face-to-face -face students don't have. Yes, you have to interact with other people in online classes. This is usually done with discussion boards which require you to post comments and questions to other students. It is very hard to hide in the back of the classroom in an online class. Online classes are varied and different just like the classes you have in the real world. They won't be all the same and classes will be different based on the experiences of your various instructors. You should learn to enjoy that and be lucky that everything is not exactly the same. It's very important to us that if you're having problems that you reach out and get help. We do not want you to wait more than three or four days to reach out and get help for any of your problems. Problems could include contacting the instructor, getting connected to a class, or other issues. Once again, don't wait more than three or four days to reach out to get help with your online class problems. There are many ways to reach out and get help. You can go to our 
e-learning website in where you'll find tutorials and resources that you can use to self-help yourself. You can visit the help desk in the basement of Heiner uh, where the help desk people can help you with login issues and other re issues related to the software you use in your online course. Other problems, you can, e you can email the e-learning staff at elearning at watcom.ctc.edu. If you're at home or on the weekend or late in the evening, you can call the statewide help number at 866-425-8412. They can help you with angel-specific problems. Make sure you reach out and get help as soon as possible. The last bit of advice is how to connect to Angel. The easiest way to get to your Angel classroom is to go to angel.watcom.ctc.edu. I hope you found this presentation useful. Enjoy your online classes.